Here's three things you can do in the face of coronavirus. <coughs> One, if you know anyone who's old or infirm, avoid face-to-face -face contact. Check in with them remotely. So call, Skype, email, or sext. I'm checking in with my local geriatric right now. Absolutely not. Two, don't be a prick. Buying 20 bottles of hand sanitizer makes it harder for other people who may need it more to get just one. And it kind of defeats the purpose of everyone else's journey apart from you. Makes it more likely that you're gonna get it. Washing your hands more regularly might chap your knuckles, but it could save a stranger's life. And also you can moisturize your animal. And I can 100% absolutely guarantee you that your life will be none the poorer for missing a stereophonics gig. In fact, there are no circumstances in which I would advise going to a stereophonics gig. But the point still remains. Avoid big crowds. Bangladeshi's queuing at Ambala. I'm looking at you. Three, join your local mutual aid group. Go to covidmutualaid.org or follow at covidaiduk on Twitter to find out how you can practically and safely support vulnerable people in your neighborhood. Thousands of people from across the country have already signed up and let's be real, Love is Blind isn't even that good anyway. Self-isolation doesn't just mean abandoning the most vulnerable people in society. If we can, we must look out for one another. <coughs> Come here, mate.